guys, welcome back. So we're gonna be doing some more clearing with that gun with the new cap, because I got my CC200 clear, it came in, and uh, I sprayed one already with it. Phenomenal with the CC200. So let's get into this video. You guys are gonna really like this one. So here's more of the PPS adapters. They came and gave me all of them for the uh, guns, all my different guns. And uh, we're gonna be putting them on the gun, setting them up. I also got some more 1.3 and 1.4 heads, so we're gonna try that out with the uh, performance gun, but we're getting all set up with the 3M, guys, so I'm looking forward to that and definitely having a cleaner cup and a nicer setup with the PPS, so let's get in here in the booth. So we're doing a fender on a van, Sienna, and a Sienna new bumper, and I'm over in the other booth too, shooting one over there. So this morning I had some trouble with my heat. My heat was off yesterday and it finally started working again. So I'm looking forward to having that working again and uh, shooting these two jobs with you guys. So we're gonna get into this gun and show you how nice it sprays with that CC200 that I'm used to. So that's a little thinner clear and it breaks it up beautiful with that new cap. So I'm really liking that new cap and uh, you guys will see how nice it lays these out. So I'm gonna spray these two jobs and clear both of them with the gun. I'm not going to show you me basing these out, but I'm going to show you me clearing them like I did the last two, but just a bumper in this booth and a fender. So let's go over to the other booth and uh, see what I got over there. I'll show you that job. So here's the other job. This is a three stage code NBL that I'm doing over here on the other side. So we got to get this one cleared. The base is drying on it now. And uh, we'll go ahead and clear this one too with that gun. But you guys are going to really like the way this sprays that CC200. So that CC200 is more of a medium solids clear. And uh, it just sprays it really nice with that gun. So I like the way that cap's working with that gun a lot better with the CC200. So you guys will see what I mean on this one. So I'm going to base these out, let them dry, and we'll go ahead and clear them, guys. So stay tuned to this one. I'm going to show you how that gun really works with that cap. All right, guys, there's the gun. I got my PPS cup on there, with my new adapter, the C2 head, and a nice clean cup. So I love the way they make those cups with the new tops on them. I'm not a fan of the DeVilbis with the way it gets real dirty and adapts onto the gun. So now I got the best of both worlds. I got my PPS with my DeVilbis gun, and uh, we're going to get into spraying this one, guys. So. Stay tuned as I show you how great this new cap is with the CC200. with that gun being it's got the uh, C2 on it so this is a clear I use all day every day so I'm familiar with this uh, clear a lot more than the other clear so I can tell how that cap is really working with this here uh, clear so definitely working out better and I'm really a fan of it so far so I'm gonna be using this cap more and we're gonna go over in the other booth and clear that job too so stay tuned I'll put another coat of clear on this one and show it to you all finished up. And same with the other, other booth. that looks guys really lays it out nice and you don't have to work so hard like you do with the DB1 cap even though I love that cap too it's almost like using that cap 
but not having to really work too hard to lay it out so let's get over in the other booth and see that Here's one this job it's all based out now guys and i'm going to go ahead and clear it and this is the three stage nbl for uh, nissan so like i was telling you guys about this gun now this c2 cap really lets you you know put it on and you don't even have to work like you used to with the c you know the c1 cap so it's like the benefits of both together now you get a flat finish but you don't have to really lay it down it's almost like you were ironing it on the clear before with the other cap you really had to work to get it to lay down but i like that i like a gun like that so this is more of you get that same look but you don't really have to work as hard to do it so this here is the job let's clear this one guys and we'll see the finished results and i'm spraying it to at the 22 psi as i normally do with that other cap so I'm trying it identical to what I normally do. And it seems to be working out great for me like that. So I'm really noticing the difference because I'm spraying at the same PSI and I'm spraying with a 1.4 and I'm spraying with the same clear. So you can really tell the difference by doing that. So I'm starting out with what I usually spray at and then I may fine tune it through the couple of days I get used to it more. But so far I like it just the way I sprayed the other gun. So let's clear this one and uh, see how it comes out. So it lays it down nice guys so definitely getting more used to it definitely enjoying it and uh we're probably going to be giving a giveaway on that sada because i'm starting to really enjoy this gun even though i really did before i think i'm going to give back to the channel and get that sada out for a uh one of my special subscribers so if you guys are new to the channel go ahead and subscribe because i'm going to be doing a giveaway on that sada 5500i that you guys seen in the last couple of videos. I used it a couple times, but I'd rather give it to one of you guys that could really use it because I got plenty of guns. So subscribe if you're new, hit the thumbs up and keep on watching them guys.